trading spaces. The epitome of crappy design. Basically, two neighbors, they trade their houses for like three months. The show will give them money, and they'll fix up the, their neighbors' houses. Sometimes it turns out great. Sometimes it turns out uh, kind of depressing. So we'll get into that. really didn't want a kid room, but, you know, I'm going to be cleaning go. up straw for the rest of my life. <laughs> Instead of, that's just straw. Number 10, Hildy's Face Room. When you hire a professional interior decorator, you usually don't expect them to put their own face on your wall. But then again, this is Hildy, so you never really know yeah. what you're gonna get. I like to be different, I like to be original. It's not about shock value, what? it's about pushing the What is that? Pushing the what is that? And helping what is that creature? Out of the box. This couple got an admittedly good room. A massive mural mosaic of Hildy's face across their dining room wall. What is that creature? This is make going. beautiful light fixtures on our budget because oh, we can't afford to buy them. The it just sounds depressing. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what happened. The murder room. I don't. Oh, Hello, that's everyone. Please. Flying and disgusting blood red, and an exquisite art project. Who thinks that that is a good idea? Unless you absolutely hate your neighbors, you want them to get arrested and have the cops called on them every time somebody goes into their house. Why? It's not... First, they noticed the concrete floor, with Susie stating that they would have to put helmets on their kids' heads when they play in the room. Who puts a concrete floor in their living room? That's just a serious question for me. Who, put his, who puts a concrete floor... This is the murder room. <laughs> a concrete floor. You're just walking through there with socks, you trip and fall and die. That's the murder room. <laughs> this is this is the first stage of that kitchen. The thing above the bed. I love the headboard. Oh, definitely the thing above the bed has got to go. When your customer calls your decoration a thing, you know they're not exactly happy with your work. What is that art? She's just got to get used to it. And here we see another universal sign of disappointment. The words, I've just got to get used to it. Right now. Um, Everything. She oh, originally refused why to open are they her all... eyes. And upon seeing... Why are all of the colors just horrible in every way? I don't know if it's the lighting from this being an older show, but something about it just makes me just depressed. In her new room, criticized its Egyptian look and painted ceiling. <laughs> Egyptian this look? Just full a painted ceiling. Okay, I can get it if you have a studio and your ceiling would be painted black for like uh lighting. We wonder if she ever got used to it. No. The Asian inspired. That's racist. Okay, demonetize the deal. When a couple tells you to do anything but Asian inspired decor, that is not code for I want Asian inspired decor. <laughs> Unfortunately, they that said... is exactly what <laughs> happened to this poor couple. Nancy and Lenny wanted anything but Asian decor. I want anything but Asian decor. Uh, I'm sorry, but all we can do is Asian decor. Nancy hated absolutely everything about the room, and even started to tear up from her disappointment. Paige then asks them to turn around, knowing full well that they're going to hate the wall behind them. The oh, straw oh room. no. Oh, wait, hold this on. This room came no. from the glorious mind of Hildy, and it of has course. to be one of the- Oh, I'm feeling something on my- Oh, oh yeah, open your, open your eyes. Oh, no. Open I'm, your I don't want to open it. Oh my god! We think Hildy is some sort of evil mastermind or something, because some of her ideas are just atrocious. If the abhorrent straw room wasn't bad enough, here we have a literal beach room. <laughs> oh, come on. Why are we still here? Just to suffer. Every night, I can feel my leg. My arm. I'm sorry guys, but this has just been too much for me. A sand floor and pink ceilings on the last one and a hay wall. Now Anyways, that. Okay, but anyways.
try and find something more depressing.